so some of you guys might recall me saying that I wasn't going to make this episode in a video a couple months back because I thought that the two stents featured in this matchup have pretty lame stand abilities. People are always asking for Goo Goo Dolls against, um, how was that stand? Little Feet from Part 5. Uh, it was two stands that make you small, but I did not enjoy either of them. Like, I don't even want to talk about them. Uh, I thought they were lame stands. So although here we are, I'm still sticking to my word. I'm really not the biggest fan of these two stands' abilities of shrinking objects or people. But after this matchup recently finding its way back into my train of thought, I really do think that these two stands would make for a great matchup considering how damn similar their abilities are. And I mean, that's seriously what this series is all about. So for today's episode of Standoff, we have two stands who, to put it simply, can make shit small. Little Feet and Goo Goo Dolls. To start off, the first stand we'll be looking at is Little Feet. For Maggio, an easygoing assassin from part 5 who possesses the stand Little Feet. We see the stand's ability during his fight with Narancia that showcases pretty much all of the stand's abilities. So Little Feet, of course, can shrink people, but in order for this ability to activate, the stand needs to come in physical contact with its target, specifically cutting the target with its extended index finger. Then, once Little Feet's target is cut, they will gradually shrink over time along with their clothing and possessions. Although for some reason Narancia's shoes stayed the same size, I think this was just to reinforce the fact that he was shrinking so he had something to freak out about, but except for that, the rest of his clothing shrunk along with him. This effect seems to have no size limit and as long as it's in effect, the target will infinitely shrink. This ability will also shrink the target stand and the range from the target to Little Feet and Formaggio is not a factor after the cut has been inflicted. So as for Formaggio's opponent, he has to wait for them to shrink and cannot increase the speed of the shrinking, but he can reverse and stop the effect. And that is what Little Feet can do to his opponents, but where I think this stand really shines is the effect that it can have on its user. This stand can shrink its user instantaneously as well as restore the user just as easily. And just, holy shit, is that a great ability to have. To someone who is unaware of the stand ability Formaggio has, he could just appear to be disappearing before their eyes or teleporting if he is able to move around well enough while shrunk. And this paired with the stand's first ability, they synergize so well together, as all Formaggio needs to do is just really hide while his target shrinks, but of course he was matched up against Aerosmith, which is pretty much the perfect counter to him, as Aerosmith has the radar ability. So although Narancia ran into a little trouble with all the rats, uh, he was generally able to locate Formaggio. Little Feet's stand stats are a D in destructive power, a B in speed, E in range, A in durability, D in precision, and C in development potential. And when I mentioned that range is not a factor with the stand after the cut has been inflicted, that still stands true. The only reason this stand has an E in range is because of how close Little Feet has to be to the target in order to inflict the cut. Now moving on to the next stand for this matchup, we have Goo Goo Dolls. The stand Goo Goo Dolls obviously also has the ability to shrink, but in a much different way from the aforementioned Little Feet. But I should probably mention the stand user, being the fabulous Guess or Gwess, an inmate of Green Dolphin Street Prison who thinks she can escape from prison with her newfound stand ability in a pretty fucked up way. So the way this stand works is that it can shrink anyone within its range, which is from 20 to 30 meters, the shrinking effect happens immediately and it makes the target uh, the, a very specific size which is about the size of a mouse. No smaller or larger. Unless the target gets further away from Gas and then they will begin to grow back to normal gradually. Or Gas can make her opponents large again instantly in order to trap them depending on the situation that they're in like we saw with Jolene. As when Jolene was tiny and she was in between a pipe, once Gas made her larger, she got stuck there. From what we have seen from this stand, Goo Goo Dolls cannot affect more than one target at a time unless you consider the shrunken dead body still under Guess's control and it cannot affect the user. Otherwise, Guess would just make herself small and escape from prison on her own. Also, the physical stand Goo Goo Dolls itself will inflict damage on the opponent or target of the stand, as Goo Goo Dolls is about the same size as uh, when the target is shrunk, and it can just inflict physical damage. But this can only be done when they're shrunk considering the stand has a D in destructive power. And even a stand with a D in destructive power inflicting damage on something the size of a mouse would probably be more like a C or a B in destructive power. As for the rest of Goo Goo Doll stand stats, we have a C in speed, a B in range of course being 20 to 30 meters, a D in durability, B in precision, and B in development potential. 
It's really damn interesting seeing what these two stand users could do with this ability and how they used it differently. Formaggio trapped Narancia inside a bottle with a spider and Guest made Jolene climb inside a hollowed out mouse carcass. But now to compare these two abilities to decide which one is the overall better stand. So let's look at how these two activate their ability in order to affect a target. In this instance, Goo Goo Dolls clearly has Little Feet B, as Guest didn't even need to come in contact with Jolene to shrink her, and she shrinks immediately to one specific size. But really, other than that one advantage, Little Feet seems to surpass Goo Goo Dolls in pretty much every other way. So, Little Feet is not limited to a range after cutting its target, although it doesn't seem that Formaggio has complete control over the size when its target is shrinking, and if he's trying to kill the target, that gives him enough time to do so once they get to a reasonable size that it would be easy to kill, or he can just hide and wait until they are just microscopic to the point where they can't do anything because they're so small or really they'll just eventually get run over or stepped on by something. But by far the biggest advantage Little Feet has over Goo Goo Dolls is its ability to affect its user. This stand ability in itself would be a pretty damn good stand ability for utility and if the user was creative enough it could find ways to be used for combat as well. The ways we see Formaggio use this ability to escape certain situations and disorient this opponent comes off as such a damn useful ability. When we first see Formaggio, he seems to just teleport inside a car, which really confuses Narancia, but in reality, he probably just shrunk himself while outside of the car, jumped in the car window, and then made himself big again, appearing that he just kind of phased through the car and just miraculously appeared inside of it. And all of this happening in just an instant, and when comparing this to Goo Goo Dolls, it makes it seem so much more limited, and Goo Goo Dolls can really only be used for combat unless Guess is using its ability with a friend and they're working together. But in the way that we saw Guess use this ability, she kind of intimidated people in order to do what she wanted them to do, rather than sort of making friends with them and saying, hey, you want to help me out? We can escape to prison. I feel like if she approached these situations better, she would have had a better chance of using her ability to escape from prison, but I guess this, that's just not the way that she is. So in the end, her stand really ended up only being used useful in combat situations, being able to shrink the opponent and then just step on them or send the physical stand Goo Goo Dolls out to attack the opponent. So right now it might seem that uh, Little Feet is way better than Goo Goo Dolls and it can do so many more things than Goo Goo Dolls, but we really can't forget the one major flaw of Little Feet and it's that it does not shrink its opponent instantly. So although this is a major flaw with the stand, it really isn't that bad because uh, Formaggio can compensate by making himself small in order to hide away from the opponent while they're shrinking. And when we saw this happening, Narancia seemed to be more focused on his own body shrinking and confused rather than worrying about what Formaggio was doing. So although Formaggio does have ways to counteract and protect himself while his opponent shrinking, that still is just a huge flaw. And if he didn't have the ability to shrink himself, the stand would probably be utter shit. But since Formaggio does have the ability to shrink himself, Little Feet is not utter shit. And mainly because of that reason and all of its previous abilities mentioned, I'm going to have to say that Little Feet is the superior stand and the winner of today's episode of Standoff. Goo Goo Dolls just falls short when compared to Little Feet because of its lack of utility purposes and just generally lack of abilities in general. So although Goo Goo Dolls can be very useful in specific situations and maybe at times better than Little Feet, but just in general, it is not as good as Little Feet. So there will be a card in the top right where you guys can vote on which stand you thought won today's episode and just is generally the overall better stand. Be sure to like this video if I fought your boredom or if you just enjoyed. Let me know in the comments section down below on what two stands you guys would like to see featured on the next episode of Standoff, and also subscribe for more videos. Thank you guys for watching, and I hope you enjoyed.